all right hey y'all welcome back to our channel as you guys can see we're gonna be doing a story time and we got wawa pizza if you guys can see so we got half and half you can do that half plain because he likes plain pizza and i got onions and pepperoni on mine the mukbang first if you want to see the story time just skip to the timestamp. stamp y'all so let us know down below if you have wawa pizza yet or not what you think of it we got the garlic crust supposedly i don't know it don't even really look true, like garlic crust but what the heck yeah we got the 14 inch it was like 13.99 i think or 12.99 so he's gonna take his slice he's gonna be the one to try it first it has the cheese pull because you guys love cheese pulls <laughs> i don't no i don't care about cheese pull i'm taking my first slice and they make this to order so i heard it was pretty good so we'll see the cheese is all right Ooh. hot oh, mm -hmm. Really hot. No, oh, they ain't. Super hot. Yeah, it's not even hot. Yes, it is. Maybe the onions and pepperoni is hot. <laughs> like hot temperature. No, no. Oh. Mine ain't hot. I'm gonna let you know how it tastes. To me, Ooh, nice. it just tastes like normal pizza. It's like nothing special. A lot of different toppings. You can create your own. But I think they have like a standard one there. And they got a bigger one. The bigger one is like, I think. Fourteen ninety nine or sixteen inches or something like that. Oh my god! You like the wrong flavor? I got zero, man. Mm -hmm. Gotta read. Gotta read. Nasty. Mm -mm -mm. So tell me about the pizza. What you think of it? Cheese. Pretty good. Is it better than Domino's? Yeah. It's better than Little Caesars. Yeah, definitely. It's better than Papa John's. No, no way. <laughs> I like it with the um the onions. It tastes good to give it a little bit more flavor. I can't believe I got zero, man. Mm. So, I feel like it's a lot of cheese on here. So, don't choke. Because it's the choke your cheese. It's not that bad. It just got a nasty aftertaste. Oh, the zero? Yeah. Mm. Mm. It's greasy. That's because of the pepperoni and all that. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna bite and taste yours. Why? You never let me eat my food by myself. She knows this. I don't know why she. I don't like... want you to do it. Take a corner bite. A small I little taste baby. The pepperoni and the you onion. are. They look. It's pepperoni uh, right there. Small. <laughs> I told you it was hot. He said it wasn't hot, right? Why are you are so hot in mine? <laughs> You saw him talking all that earlier and the karma got him. <laughs> Why is yours so hot? I don't know. He done burnt the roof of his mouth. No, I burnt my bottom lip. Mm -mm -mm. The pepperoni landed right on my lip. That's gonna hurt tomorrow. This is not garlic crust neither. They lied. Mm -hmm. Give me that one you touch. So, out of 10, what do you give the pizza? Seven. Mm. I guess I'm on par with that as well. I give it a 6.5, actually, because, matter of fact, I give it a 6 because they lied to us. They didn't give us the garlic crust. It wasn't extra, either, so. The toppings was extra, though. I think they are like a dollar extra or something like that. So, I guess I give it, I don't eat crust anyway, no matter what the pizza is. For me, it's a lot of cheese. So, if you guys want to try the Wawa pizza, go ahead and try that. The pizza is okay. It's not bad. Yeah, the crust tastes like regular pizzeria to me, honestly. The yeah, crust, it don't. It tastes nasty. Not nasty, but... Not the not, crust. I meant the under, under part, whatever um, it's called. The crust don't taste like nothing. Mm. Got no taste to it. And they burnt it a little bit. Mm. Well, it's made to order, so... Depends on who's making it. Somebody else name was getting a pizza. I think it was like on DoorDash or something like that. On to the story time. Oh, well, it's going to be the story time about our first fight. I'll let you know. We have many after that. Many, many many fights after that so <laughs> basically it started off because we were still talking at the time i believe it wasn't like officially boyfriend and girlfriend whatever but an ex basically that they got the same name same name as me she mailed him first of all no, she had she touched me. i wasn't going that far back but she had texted him one night i was in my house he was waiting for me to come out came out he, he was like i think he said guess who texted me and i was like who and then he told me if he about that i told her as soon as she came out i ain't hide nothing I was iffy, iffy about that and stuff. I was just like, eh, whatever. We spent the whole day together already, so I wasn't really, like, worrying about it too much. But I knew the kind of relationship that they had. And I didn't have her number stored in my phone. Yeah, because I watched his videos, and I knew, like, he was really, like... To me, on the video, it seemed like he was in love, honestly. Like, that's what it seemed like to me. So I was just, like, taking that 
at face value, like, oh yeah, he must have really loved her, whatever. She took it. She took it where he left. I wasn't in love. That's what it seemed like on the videos. So I did love her, right? But I wasn't in love with her. Anyway, I was only in love with one person. That's not me. <laughs> yet, anyway. Yet. Yet. Child, please. Anyway, so Tom passed by. I don't know if it was like a day later or two days later. He was like, oh, she had emailed him. So I was like, okay, now is the problem. Now, you know, the text was there. I like, she you didn't text, shut it down. Man, let me tell you something. She texted me. I didn't answer. I blocked the number. You so, told me that you answered. And y'all was talking till like 2 o'clock in the morning or something. You told me that. I remember this. I remember. He's not going to remember this ever. He's never going to remember. You told me I that. I told you we was talking to about 2 o'clock in the morning. Not on the, the phone. Morning. In the text. She said something. You said something. She said, how are you? Or something like, are you, are you good? Something like that she said. I remember the first text. And um, you said you said something to her. And then she blocked you. You don't remember? You said that. First of all, I never said I was talking that's to her until 2 o'clock in the morning. 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock. She'd something. be exaggerating. That, I don't even remember. It. <laughs> See, he didn't her. remember. No, I didn't. know because we wasn't talking that long. And anyway, I blocked her after the little words were said. And then she emailed me. Yeah, he told me while he was at work. So I was like, mm, I don't really like that. I said, you should shut it down. Do whatever you got to do. And I did. To make sure that she knows that you're not interested or whatever it was. So she, It wasn't even like that. She wasn't trying to get back with me or nothing like that. I don't know. What do I know? I didn't see the email. I didn't even really see the text. Just the one text. Now, y'all, comment below. I told her right away. Like, as soon as she texted me, when she came outside, as soon as she got in the car, yo, bam, 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 this is what's going on. She emailed me. I got to work. I told her. Bang. This is what's going on. If, if, if there was something going on, I would have hit it. Don't you think? Like. I told her right away. I wasn't hiding nothing. He said he would have hid it, not hit it. Son, you said hit. <laughs> I said hid. Son, you said hit, though. That's what I heard. But anyway. Because you so, got you know, wax in your ears. No. That's what I heard. She don't clean her ears. Yes, I do. There's wax in there. No, Can't not. hear. Anyway, so we was going back and forth while he was at work and stuff like that. I was, like, mad about it and stuff. Mind you, my ex was blowing me up still, like... OD blowing me up, but I was shutting well, it down. Never shutting tell it down. Me. Yes, I did. Stop lying. I was shutting it down, whatever. And he even watched our YouTube videos before. So he knew that we had something going on. So that's that. If you're watching right now, I'm talking about you. We're just going back and forth. I was on the phone with him during his work shift. And, you know, I kept pushing and pushing and talking about it and telling him, like, you know, I feel uncomfortable, this and that. He kept, you know, trying to reassure me that nothing's going on. I don't have to worry, blah, blah, blah. And she just kept going and going and going. Yeah, because he was nice back then. So I knew I could keep on pushing it and pushing it and pushing I it. I was nice back then. Come on now, stop it. He was nice back then. Mm, we didn't know each other like that. I just let things slide more than I do now. <clears throat> so... After that, like, it came to a point where he was just like, you know what, I'm going to talk to you later or whatever. And I was like, that took me, like, back. Like, I was just like, what? You going to talk to me later? I said, why? He was saying that he was getting mad or something like that. I don't know. Remember I'm saying. at work and she's trying to argue with me. I wasn't really arguing. I was just telling him, like, I don't like the situation. Like, I feel uncomfortable. I heard you the first nine and, times you said it. And that was it. But he was, he kept letting me go on, so I kept on going on. So anyway, he said he going to come say. back later. And I was like, something. I don't know what you said. And then, like, I don't know if you kind of hung up the phone on me. You probably just, did. No, I told you I'm going to talk to you later. And then I didn't say nothing else. I just was like, you going to talk to me later. Hanging up is. You going to talk to me later. Uh, click. No. Mm -hmm. I'm going to talk to you later. Bye. Click. I was shocked that he got mad at me. I was like, what the heck? Like, that's so weird. Like, because not you, even together. You like, kept acting like something. Exactly. So why are you was pressing me like that? Because we was about to get together, so I had to know. You don't want like, all of those, right? Yes, I do. I had to know what was up. I'm not going to. Some things is little. That's one thing about them, too. They little. I'm not going to play no games. I have no time for that type of stuff. So anyway, he was mad. I'm pretty sure he called me when he got off of work. No, I didn't. Yes, I did. No, I didn't. I don't believe that. You called me. I you text me, matter of fact. You saying you remember the story? I do remember the story. You text me. I said what? And asked me, was I still mad? Yeah, of course not. <laughs> Call me. That's what you said. No. <laughs> so, anyways, that's basically it. I wasn't story. really mad. I just didn't want to go back and forth for her while I was at work. He saw he had the OD attitude, so I was like, oh. I had a little, you know, a little something in there. What is going on? A little something was going on. Like I said, that was our first fight, not our last. We're both Aries, so it's going to happen. We're going to clash. Like, we're just going to clash, 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 and clash, and clash. So 
you know that's what it is when you have double uh what is it signs or whatever the same sign that's hard if people get along so yeah that's pretty much it you got anything to add nothing what it's her. No, it's, it's him for sure. Definitely. It's definitely him. I swear to you. It's definitely Eric. No, it's not. No, it's don't believe the hype. We need we need like a uh, we need one of our therapists, man. Who who's licensed? Who's a licensed therapist that watches, man? We need help. <laughs> bro. We need help. Yeah, we do. But anyway, that's pretty much it. If um you guys have any questions, leave it down below. Why why pizza like mm, six? For me. As I'm eating it, to me, it's more like a, I'm going to say a seven, like a smooth seven. If you look at it, I looks, I'll give it an eight. Taste, the cheese and the sauce is okay, it's good. Crust and the dough is not it. Mm. They burnt it. That's another thing. They didn't give us the garlic crust. That's two against them. If y'all watch JL Jupiter, he uh, did a review on it. So he also said something about they need to work on the dough. Yeah, so. the dough is not is not hitting, bro. Like, and it's I don't like me. I don't like I don't like when my pizza's fresh out because I don't like that crunch. Like, I don't like the crunch of the dough. Like, I don't like that. I like it to be like what is the texture when it's not crunchy? Like, soft? what do you call that? Not like soft, but yeah, I guess soft. I don't know. I don't like the crunch. I like to let my pizza sit for a little bit. Like, when I go there, I always tell them not too hot when they reheat it so it don't be crunchy. Like, I don't like the crunchy pizza. And you know what's crazy? Like, you guys know that I'm from New York or I lived in New York for a long time. I had probably almost all of the New York pizzas. I had some of the best of the best rated top pizzas. We even had some of the best rated top pizza in New York City. Remember the one by Bridge, remember? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's some of the best rated pizza. So, you know, we going, like, from high scale, basically, to... Wawa pizza so it's kind of more of like a critical rating basically so yeah i like i said i give it a seven i probably anthony really franco's like it. is better than that brooklyn joint not to me i like the sauce Just, sauce is really good it was good but it wasn't like i didn't expect that type of pizza that it was we i expected regular pizza but it was some other some the other best stuff. pizza in new york is supposedly joe's pizza i've never had it. i think it's on they had one on Foy's oh Street. yeah yeah matter of fact yeah i did have good yeah is it it's good me best. personally, Anthony Franco's. If y'all ever heard of Anthony Franco's, if it's where y'all at, I don't know if they all over so. the place, but I know they in Jersey. They all over Jersey. They're good, man. It's just everything they do. Like even when the pizza first come out, it's not crunchy. Everything about Anthony Franco's pizza is amazing to me. The sauce, the cheese, the dough, the crust. I eat the whole thing. The preference things. I had the pizza before, and it wasn't like to me. It wasn't the best. I don't think I ever had the best, 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 best. But I had dollar slices. I had. The best, supposedly, you know? So, yeah. Anyway, that's our review of the pizza. That's our story time. Let, Let us, us know, know down, down below what else what you else guys, guys want to eat. eat. No, so no, you mess, so you me, mess up. me up. I'm not keeping that. I'm not keeping that. Anyways, we'll see you guys in the next video.